Today's topic of discussion, GMOs and organic food. So what exactly is a GMO? I know we hear them everywhere. We see them all over the news and all over the labels, no GMOs. GMOs are genetically modified organisms. First of all, I do not have some crazy degree. I am not a scientist, but I have done a lot of research on this. Our population is growing quickly and we're having a really hard time keeping up with it. I think for the most part, the people coming up with GMOs are not horrible human beings. I think they're really just trying to help out our population. One thing to keep in mind is they are not natural. I think that anything that we put in our bodies that is not natural is not meant to be in our bodies. Genetically modified, meaning not natural. Now, what is this organic craze? Organic everywhere, organic or non-organic, what do you do? My third video, you guys were all laughing about that natty light. You look at me and say, hypocrite. I know, that makes no sense. Moderation is the key here. Most of the time, organic food is a little bit more expensive. So what do we do? When you go to the grocery store, you wanna look at the prices. Obviously, organic is most of the time gonna be better because it means that there's been no pesticides or chemicals or GMOs used when creating that vegetable or fruit. There are some of us out there that cannot afford everything organic. I get it, it's a little bit more expensive. Just because it says natural doesn't mean that it's any better for you. Speaking of natty light or natural light, come on now, do you really think that that is natural? That is a great example of something that's labeled natural that might not necessarily be natural. Casey, just get to the point already. My point is, when you can, buy organic. Organic is not a gimmick. Please start caring about what you put in your body. We're following the leader, the leader, the leader. We're following.